Hi, my name is David. Today we're going to do a CSS grid tutorial on free code camp. And we're going to learn about the grid template areas property. So what this does is that it lets us group cells on your grid together into an area and we can give a custom name for it. So we, if we look at this, this is the syntax for it. And each of this represents an item or cell inside of it. And we see these first three cells are ha have a header name. And that means we're grouping those three cells together. And this was a group, this is a group, and this is a group. If we don't want to have a name for it, we can use a period as the custom label to designate an empty cell in the grid. So for this exercise, we have this grid already. Let's look at it. We have five a container, five items. Each item is three rows, three columns. And this is the name for it. And we want to change the advert label to an empty one. So all we have to do is delete this and give it a period. And that's all for this one. Thank you so much.